This is your primetime forecast for East Alabama and West Georgia from Dr. Don's Weather. Dr. Don's Weather is made possible by the Randolph County Commission, First Light Coffee, Roger Bell Auto Brokers, Southern Auction Solutions, Genesis Sweet Clinic, Jimmy Stevens Construction, Anchor Roofing, The Town of Wadley, Auction 431 South, The Salem Auction House, and Bama Diesel Repair. From the Alpha Weather Center, powered by Boondocks Barbecue and Creamery, Southern Union State Community College, and the venue at Five Points Farms, here's Dr. Don. How to do East Alabama to West Georgia. Welcome to your Monday, May 13th, 2024 on Dr. Don's Weather. I hope you're making plans to join us this Saturday at the Roanoke Rec Center for the 49th annual bike hike. We're going to be giving away NOAA weather radios, so I hope that you will come by. We're going to have a QR code set up on the table. All you have to do is scan that QR code with your phone, fill out your name, uh, your location, and your email address, and then before we leave uh, on Saturday, we're going to draw to give away some NOAA weather radios. Now, we will be broadcasting live starting at 7 a.m. on Saturday morning at the Roanoke Rec Center on West Point Street in Roanoke, and we'll be there until the bike hike is done. Registration starts at 8, and the bike hike, walk, run, ride, however you want to do it, starts at 9 a.m. on Saturday morning. So be sure and come by, and uh, let me shake your hand, hug your neck, and let you register for a NOAA weather radio that we're going to be giving away. Actually, we're going to give away more than one. Uh, so stop by for your chance to win on Saturday morning at the Roanoke Rec Center. It is the 49th annual bike hike. Again, registration starts at 8 a.m. The bike hike starts at 9. Uh, we're going to have all kinds of fun going on. We've got train rides. We've got Hawaiian shaved ice. We've got the bouncy house. Of course, we'll be broadcasting live. We will also be drawing for other prizes and raffles. We've got uh, balloon animals for the kids, face painting. Chick-fil-A will be there. Also, Hanley High School will be, uh, the Hanley High School band will be making funnel cakes and fried Oreos. So come by, have a good time with us, support the Randolph County Learning Center on Saturday morning. Also, be sure you get in touch with Jamie Dukas. Let Jamie show you how he can save money. He'll going to put money back in your pocket. And in a lot of cases, he can increase your insurance coverage, and he can handle your personal and commercial insurance, both in Alabama and Georgia. Scan the QR code on the screen, click the link at the top of the video, or call Jamie at 256-831-7770 for more information on how Jamie Dukas can save you money with your insurance through Alpha Insurance. Be sure you head over to our YouTube channel, click that subscribe button and the little bell so that when we go live to cover severe weather, you'll be guaranteed to get that notification. Could have some strong thunderstorms down to our south today. Uh, we could be looking at a few thunderstorms that could go severe, I think, south of Montgomery for the most part. If you're going to be traveling down to Orange Beach, Mobile, Gulf Shores, uh, make sure you know what the weather forecast is as you travel down I-65. There could be some big ones down there. Uh, and we're looking at uh, that lasting throughout most of uh, the morning uh, this afternoon and into tomorrow morning. You, you'll notice that up here across East Alabama and West Georgia, we should stay below severe limits today. Now, as we look at tomorrow, the entire state has a one out of five risk of maybe a strong thunderstorm, 60 mile per hour wind gust and quarter sized hail. Uh, but it's a very marginal risk. I don't look for widespread severe weather on your Tuesday. But if we're going to have any strong thunderstorms, it'll be tomorrow afternoon between 5 p.m. and 10 p.m. across East Alabama and West Georgia. And we're going to have to watch for the possibility of the same thing again toward Thursday night and Friday, maybe even lingering into Saturday morning of this upcoming weekend. We'll know more about that, hopefully by tomorrow morning. Taking a look at your current conditions at the venue at Five Points Farms, currently 62.5 degrees, feels like 62.7. No wind, the humidity is 96%, the barometric pressure 30.02. The dew point is 61. We have had six one hundredths of an inch of rain so far, but 
The rain is falling now. It'll be a wet day across the region. High temperature of 76.7 yesterday. We do have rain showers in the area. Sunrise this morning was at 541. The sun sets this evening at 734 p.m. It'll be a cloudy, rainy day with occasional rumbles of thunder. 70 will be the high in Roanoke, 68 in Ranburn. We'll make it to 70 in Anniston. Alexander City tops out at 72. And we'll hit 72 in Auburn, Alabama. Taking a look at your six-day forecast from the Alpha Weather Center. Yeah, for Monday, a 90% chance of showers and maybe, again, a rumble of thunder from time to time. We're not looking for severe weather today, but um, anytime you've got thunderstorms in the area, there is that possibility. So be weather aware, but I don't anticipate any problems from storms today. 70, you're high down to 63 tonight. 80% chance of rain this evening, probably through about 8 or 9 p.m., and then on Tuesday, a 70% chance of showers, perhaps a thunderstorm, 78 will be the high. We could see a strong to marginally severe thunderstorm on your Tuesday. 62, your overnight low with a 60% chance of rain. Wednesday and Thursday certainly look like the best two days of the week. Mostly sunny on Wednesday, 79. Thursday, sunshine, 84. Another storm system moves in late Thursday with a 50% chance of rain. Friday, showers and thunderstorms. We're watching for the possibility of some strong to severe weather on Friday. We'll let you know more about that tomorrow. 75 will be the high. 80% chance of rain Friday night. And we're going to hang on to a 40% chance of showers and scattered thunderstorms on Saturday. 82 will be your high temperature as we get your next weekend underway. Now, let's take a look at your Southern Union State Community College Live Doppler HD radar. And you can see that big rain mass really stretching from Birmingham all the way down to the Gulf Coast region and back into southern Mississippi. And we do have multiple areas of severe weather ongoing this morning. We have a severe thunderstorm warning now for northern Mobile County stretching back into the uh, Mississippi area near Hattiesburg. And then we have another severe thunderstorm warning just to the west of Dothan. Uh, and we're going to zoom in for you and show you those right quick. If you're down here traveling uh, from Enterprise down to Geneva and then back over to western Houston County, we have that severe thunderstorm warning that's in effect down there. And then looking back at Mobile, you see there from uh, about the causeway back up to Centronel, we have a severe thunderstorm warning, and that does stretch back into portions of Mississippi as well. We zoom back out, you can see that we have some heavier small pockets of showers right along the I-85 corridor and just west of Montgomery back over toward Linden. And then some more concentrated steady rain up toward Clanton and then back over to Ashland and Wadley about to move into Roanoke. And that will continue moving off to the east. Good news here is uh, all of the stronger storms are expected to stay down here in South Alabama and northwest Florida. Don't look for much in the way of strong to severe storms in East Alabama or West Georgia. For those of you watching us in North Georgia, uh, just very light showers, so sprinkles really, uh, from about Cornelia all the way back over into Northwest or Northeast Alabama, stretching down across the Atlanta Metro. That should fill in as we go throughout the day, and some of this heavier green will make it certainly into the Atlanta Metro. I think most of it stays south of the I-85 corridor, but uh, yeah, occasional shower up here across North Georgia, certainly not out of the question for today. Don't forget to follow us over on X, formerly Twitter. We broadcast all of our weather information on X, just as we do on Facebook, YouTube, and at drdonwx.com. Once again, don't forget, we're going to be giving away NOAA Weather Radios this Saturday at the 49th Annual Bike Hike at the Roanoke Rec Center on West Point Street in Roanoke. We will open it up for registration for the NOAA Weather Radios around 7 a.m. Saturday morning, and we'll continue to let you register all the way up until our final hour, which will probably be some Somewhere around between 9 and 10 a.m. And we'll start giving away those NOAA weather radios. So be sure you stop by and register and hang out with us. Have a good time. I love to come back home and get to see you guys. This is a great opportunity for us 
uh, to shake hands and hug necks. And uh, I, that's just my most favorite thing to do. So I hope that a lot of you make your plans to come hang out with us on Saturday morning at the Roanoke Rec Center. Have a fantastic Monday. Good Lord willing, and the creek don't rise. I'll see you back in here first thing tomorrow morning for another edition of your primetime forecast on Dr. Don's Weather. This has been your primetime forecast for East Alabama and West Georgia from the Alpha Weather Center, powered by Southern Union State Community College, the venue at Five Points Farms and Boondocks Barbecue and Creamery. Dr. Don's Weather is supported by the Randolph County Commission, First Light Coffee, Roger Bell Auto Brokers, Southern Auction Solutions, Genesis Sway Clinic, Jimmy Stevens Construction, Anchor Roofing, The Town of Wadley, Auction 431 South, The Salem Auction House, and Bama Diesel Repair. Be sure to like us on Facebook, share us with all of your friends, and subscribe to Dr. Don's Weather on YouTube. We will be back tomorrow morning with another edition of your primetime forecast on Dr. Don's Weather.